How often do you hear a woman actually say she's bad in bed? Actually say that she's trash? How often do you ever hear a woman say that her vag is not good? It's like, oh, you don't want any of this. Oh, fool. Open a window. <laughs> Seriously. Her wife got problems. But how often as a man do you hear that? You hear any woman admitting her bedroom skills are lacking and that her nether regions are lacking as well. Lacking. It's not often as men you hear a woman say her bedroom skills were average at best. At best. At best. So I have an interesting video for you today, as always. Five things every man wants in bed, but won't ask for, but won't ask for. Ah. Things many men want, but are too afraid to tell a woman, you know, what he wants her to do, you know? Interesting. From the channel Helen Hart, but this is not Helen Hart in the video. No one cares. Interesting. But my elegant, eloquent title is <laughs> Trash in Bed. What women never hear. This is why many women become leftover women. <laughs> <laughs> oh god I, you know I, I really uh, sometimes i think i really shouldn't be a youtuber I, I probably shouldn't be a youtuber but interesting title for an interesting video because my point is i wonder how many women actually understand and know that some men leave you because the sex was rubbish it's like how often as a woman do you actually hear that any women listening that the sex was rubbish. Trash already. Trash. That's why he left. That's why you can't keep a man. You know, somewhat vulgar, somewhat vulgar to say this, but I mean, some women are very much used to getting done, but in all that time, they haven't developed any skills in <laughs> getting done. <laughs> They're just used to getting done. Just like a woman. Just because men indulge in you, it does not mean all the men that indulge in you enjoy it. Something women should understand. The thing is, many men won't say it. Like many men won't say what they want sexually, some men won't tell you what your problem is sexually, women. Pay attention. This is why you don't hear many men say that, yeah, some women are actually trash in bed. Even though more than enough men can tell you, yeah, some women are actually trash in bed. But it's not something many women hear often enough. And admittedly, admittedly, as men, you can say it's probably, you know, bad as men that we actually make women believe that all of them have great, you know, <laughs> sexual skills. <laughs> Oh God, she's used to getting done, but she, she can't do anything. She can't do anything properly. Oh God. Wow. Wow. But I hope you're doing well. Hope you're having a nice day. Hope your week has been good. Hope you've had a good weekend. But this, of course, is Replicant Fish. Welcome back. Glad you could join me again. The international man of mystery. Yeah. Yeah, that's kind of whack. Replicant Fish. Yeah. Let's begin. Hi there, I'm Céline Rémy. I'm so grateful that Helena Hart invited me today to be a special guest on her channel so that I could share with you all about what every man wants in bed. But before we get started, if you are new to Helena's channels and you're not yet subscribed, Helena is going to help you to attract the man you want and inspire his love, devotion and commitment. What? Inspire his love, devotion and commitment wow wow <laughs> wow powerful words powerful words <laughs> yeah you love devotion and commitment yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> good luck women good luck <laughs> all right but seriously seriously to be more grown yeah some women can inspire that from some men i guess now who wouldn't want that so in this video i'm going to share with you five things that i think every man really wants in the bedroom and sometimes they're just a little bit shy to ask for them, but if you can show up in the bedroom with those skills, they would absolutely love that. Yeah, but as a man to say it, you're somewhat vulgar, you're being rude to women. Oh, how dare you say women need to learn sexual skills? Because they do. Because they do. To every woman that hears this, understand. No one cares. Yeah, getting done doesn't mean you're good. You know, there are many factors at work, you know? the wall and your walls yeah, let's carry on so the first thing that every man wants in bed is your pleasure men love it when we are happy they just want to give us pleasure want to give you the d want to give you the d about pleasure give you the d give her the d all right come on come on mature they, they they want to they want to make love to you in other words men want to make love to you when they see you as you know happy wanton yeah <laughs> wanton happy wanton women yeah they want to see us in pleasure 
And to be really honest, the only reasons they want to become better in bed is because then they can satisfy us more. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay, yes, yes, true, yes, true. You know, in some cases, some men, you know, they feel like, yeah, I want to satisfy my woman. If she's your woman and she's not a random chicky banging. But if she's your woman, obviously a man wants to feel like he's going to satisfy his woman, you know? You're going to remember this, D. You're going to remember, all right, but you know what I mean? You know what I mean? Just make her feel good with intercourse please please yeah you know your girlfriend doesn't want intercourse yeah she doesn't yeah it's not yeah don't carry on and that's really important to them so if you can show him that you really are enjoying yourself that you are experiencing pleasure either by verbally sharing it with him or by allowing like moans and groans of pleasure <laughs> yeah yeah moan yeah scream for me scream all right all right i'm joking i'm joking I'm joking. I'm probably going to edit that out. I'm, I'm joking. <laughs> yeah, obviously the audio and visual sensory, you know, you know, can obviously, you know, increase, increase the pleasure. <laughs> yeah, she could be faking it though. So, you know, she could be faking it. So yeah, that as well. That will really give him the right message that you are enjoying yourself and it will also be a massive turn on for him to witness you in your pleasure. You know, part of the reason I picked this video is because I like her accent. Pleasure, pleasure, pleasure. In your pleasure, pleasure. And I think probably that's why Helena picked her as well, because her accent works <laughs> with what she's talking about. Pleasure. But it could, it's probably, it's probably just me. It's probably just me. The second thing that every man wants in bed is for you to give him attention. I thought she was going to say something else. <laughs> Head? No, no. <laughs> Seriously. Yeah, but yeah, but yeah, 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 women, yeah. Learn. Flipping learn. Pleasure. Coming over here with these trash skills. Get lost. Wasting my flipping time. It's for you to give him attention to his... What? Attention to his... Whoa, 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 whoa. So, so I'm going to have to kind of bleep her out because she's going to get, you know, quite explicit with some of her wording. So I'm going to probably replace her words with, you know, some of my words just to make it a bit more YouTube friendly. Oh God, intercourse. I don't think you can ever give his... Shlong. ...too much attention. Whether it's a, a BJ, a HJ job or just a hand grab passing when you're passing through the kitchen. The fact that you can celebrate his sexuality and his penis is really going to boost him. Pleasure. Yeah, women and bust him as well. And bust him. Pay attention, women. Pay attention. <laughs> A lot of men associate their worth and self-esteem with a penis. So if you can bring that attitude of celebration and appreciation around his penis. <laughs> yeah, yeah, women, celebrate the knob. Yeah, as a woman, learn to celebrate the knob. If not, you could become a leftover woman that no man wants because you don't know how to celebrate a knob. Yeah? Not a knob of a man, but you know, let's just say, you know what I mean? You know what I mean, women? You know what I mean? Pay attention. It will really boost his desire for you. He will feel seen. He will feel appreciated. And when that happens, he will want to give more to you. Let's do her again. Ah. The third thing that every man wants in bed is for you to be present with him and also for you to want it. Obviously, you want her to want it. You don't want to be chafing yourself, just like, just getting yourself all chafed up. Just, you know, let's carry on. You know, if you're just laying there, counting and hoping like in a few minutes he's going to be done. Yeah, yeah, that, yeah, 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 there you go, women. That doesn't mean you're good in bed. A point women should understand, and I've made this point before, the benefit of being a man is that more than likely we're going to we're going to orgasm as a man, you know, we're going to get off during sex. The thing is, for many women, it's not the same way. I mean, not all women experience a full, you know, <laughs> a full busting, let's, a full busting for delicate words or <laughs> multiple, you know? But I do believe some women think that they have good nether regions and that the sex is good because men, because men climax. Yeah, w women, no, no, no. Men are going to climax anyway. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of the benefit of being a man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the world is mine. No, seriously, seriously, seriously. Yeah, it is the benefit of being a man. But this is why I think some women delude themselves to think they're good in bed because they make a man just 
climax. Like, nah, nah sorry. It was going to happen anyway. Got mine. You didn't get yours. No one cares. No one cares. <laughs> no one cares. <laughs> The fourth thing that every man wants in bed is for you to be confident. Confidence is absolutely sexy. A woman who is willing to ask for what she wants and is not afraid not only to ask and but go for what she wants is a massive turn on. Yeah, good point. Yeah, good point. And relates to what I just said about women, you know, being suffering from anxiety sexually, you know, her energies, her insecure energies. <laughs> Which is a sense of, yeah, you could ruin the sex and the experience for the man as well, you know, because some women are, some women are actually quite selfish and they don't think about the man. Yeah, like how many men are afraid to ask for what they want as well, as are many women. Yeah, as are many women. But obviously, obviously, but obviously, you know, women aren't used to that because many women don't need to ask. Many women are having D thrust upon them to even really need to ask for it. But you get what I mean. You get what I mean. The benefit of being a man is, yes, we have to approach and men can get rejected, but we still have to approach. Women have to wait for the D to come to them and pick from the selection of D she wants. Yeah, that was a bit much. That was a bit much. But, but yeah, some women don't think that at the time. And the fifth thing that every man wants in bed is to have clear, concise, direct communication. Do you want it in your mouth or what? Yeah. No, seriously, seriously, <laughs> seriously. <laughs> now, he doesn't want to be a Jedi mind reader. He doesn't want to have to guess at all time what you're thinking or wanting. He likes you to use your voice. He likes it when you share your desires, when you share your fantasy. He likes it when you want to be kinky, when you want to be kinky, kinky. Silence, you fool. But something women should know and many men know, you all don't have great vaggies. I'm just, I'm not being crude. It's just, yeah, it's kind of true. And as men, pay attention. Yes, it's nice if a woman's giving you some and she wants to throw some on you, but be careful as well. In some cases, there's a reason for this. Her biological clock may be ticking. She may be getting on. She could have those baby rabies. As a man, learn to strap up and bail out. Bail out. Here, here, woof, woof, as men, yeah. In other words, in other words, in other words, focus. Observe. Remember. The world is yours. Have a nice day.